the right to vote. It's an idea that has evolved continuously since the country's birth. When a U.S. citizen turns 18 years old, they're guaranteed the right to vote. But it wasn't that long ago when high school graduates didn't have that opportunity. They could give their life for their country, but they couldn't go to the ballot box. That changed in 1971 with the passage of the 26th Amendment to the U.S. Constitution, and a West Virginia senator named Jennings Randolph led the charge. Senator Randolph was deeply, passionately concerned about the ability for 18, 19, and 20 year olds to vote. Jennings Randolph personally escorted the young lady who was the first person to register to vote to the courthouse in Elkins. When people talked to Randolph, they knew that they could take it to the bank. Jennings was, uh, he was one of a kind, I think. If this young person is going to lay down their life, for all of us to have the freedoms that we enjoy, we ought to at least give them the right to be able to go and cast their ballot. 